Welcome to another GL veneer species feature. In this installment, we're going to be taking a closer look at quarter cut Atimawe. It's a West African hardwood whose trees can get up to 165 feet tall. In West African hardwood, Atimawe trees grow very large and are often found towering in the rainforest canopy over other tropical trees. Fairly common in these lush African environments, the Timway veneer is actually pretty rare. Basically because its primary commercial use is for rubber, which is extracted by tapping the tree. Now it's not uncommon to hear a Timway called African rosewood because it does have a strikingly familiar grain pattern and wonderful curly figure, which is what you find in rosewoods, even though it's not even closely related to them. Then you see its color and time seems to stop. The Timaway's heartwood blends rich, reddish-brown hues with striking black features, similar to Okoa or mahogany. While its grain is generally straight or slightly interlocked, the Timaway has a medium texture and good natural luster. And that's before you apply a top coat. Afterward, its mesmerizing character really takes center stage. Combine its rosewood-like appearance with its rare usage as veneer, and Atimaway's exotic aura grows. Almost always sold as veneer, Atimaway is often used as architectural paneling and trim. So if it's on your short list of options, head to the GL Veneer website where we have literally billions of square feet of veneer, including all cuts, sizes, and backer options for Atimaway. <laughs>